to another lesson in the TI30X Plus Math Print Student course. In this lesson, we introduce the function table feature. To access the feature, press table. And you see there that we've got add edit func, which allows you to define a function and generate a table of values. You see number two is F open bracket. That allows you to evaluate a function F at a particular X value on the home screen. G open bracket allows you to evaluate function G at a particular X value on the home screen. We're going to press number one to add a function. Now the function we're going to introduce is from our example. And the example is the surface area of a sphere is given by the function a of x equals four pi x squared, where x is the radius and is greater than zero. And we're going to use the function table to calculate the surface area of the following spheres. They have um, radii 2, 5, 8, and 11, respectively. So first of all, let's enter the function. So we press 4, then the multiplication key, then pi, then multiplication key, then we press the variable key to access x, and then we press x squared. So we've entered our function. And once we've done that, we now press enter. Now, notice these arrows, we can either scroll down or we can press enter again. And it takes us to our table setup. And what you see there is start specifies the starting value for x. And notice at the moment, it's set to zero. Step specifies the step length for x and notice that it's currently set at one which means x values increase by one auto generates a series of values for y based on the start and step values and ask x allows you to build a table manually for chosen values of x so for our example we're going to have a start value of Two, which we enter, then down arrow. Now our radii were two, five, eight, and 11, which means our step is three. And we want the auto feature. So we go uh, and highlight auto, then down again to highlight calc, which is short for calculate. Press enter, and here we have our table. So for example, when the radius is two, the surface area of the sphere is 16 pi. Notice that it's an exact answer. To get the decimal answer, we can press the fraction or exact value decimal toggle button here, and notice that it gives you um, an approximate value there uh, in decimal point form, 50.26. And to obtain other values in the table, go back here, scroll down to five, scroll down to eight, scroll down to 11. So that's showing you the surface area uh, for the four spheres uh, that we wished to calculate. That's it for this lesson. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.